everyone and welcome back to day two of our Disney trip. Uh, we're just walking up to the park now. There's the Disneyland Hotel. Ella's also vlogging today, so go check out her channel. I'll leave the link below. We're just coming up to the Halloween Mickey. It's so cute. Oh my gosh. I love it. We'll have to get a closer look of it, but... I'm obsessed with how much Disneyland Paris are going into detail with the Halloween decorations today. It's behind the scenes of Princess Ella WDW on Instagram. <laughs> this view is stunning. We've also got our matching spirit jerseys on today. Repping the Disneyland Paris spirit jerseys. Oh my gosh. This hotel is stunning. I'd love to stay here one day. Definitely on the bucket list, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, on the bucket list. Uh, Mum and Dad have also got their spirit jerseys on. Ella is wearing pink, because it's Ella. <laughs> but she has brought her spirit jersey with her, so we can maybe get a picture of us all in them together. Big family photo. Yep. Yeah. And I've got my Zero necklace on again, because I've got these Jack Skellington ears on. I've also got Nightmare Before Christmas nails. Which she did herself. Yes. <laughs> so right near the exit of the park, here is the Disneyland Hotel. And then this little area here is the cutest thing I've ever seen. I just imagine Bambi being here. It's so pretty, I just took some photos. These really cool ears. And you start off with this and you can any character you want on, I would get Jack. I'd probably do Jack on each side. And this is what it looks like. It's really cute. So the headband is actually only $13.99, but the, the bits you add to it, they are $9.99 each. I don't think the headband's a bad price though, if you just wanted this. As soon as we came in, there was the Maleficent um, dragon float, so I got a quick video of that we ran to go get a run after the parade. Yeah, we got a good view of it, and we got a fire shot, which was cool. Yeah. I was worried though because I thought it might set these on fire, <laughs> but yeah. luckily, no pyrotechnics uh, went wrong. <laughs> Me and Ella are both in the line to get something off the Halloween menu at the bakery. I think I'm gonna get the chocolate. Cookie, the dark night cookie. What are you gonna get? I think I'm gonna get, I don't know, either of these two, something chocolate. Yeah. The other cookie is white chocolate and raspberry, which sounds really good, but I'd just need the chocolate. Yeah. Are you gonna get a drink? Yeah, I think I'm just gonna get a bottle of water. What are you gonna get? No, I'm kind of gonna move the iced tea, I think, because I'm in Paris. And... Oh my god, I might do the same now you said that. Yeah, I'll do iced tea as well. So we just went to the bakery and I got the Dark Knight cookie. We also got the Twilight white chocolate and raspberry one to share. This is what the other one looks like, Ella, do you want to? Here with him. Here you go. So that's white chocolate raspberry, so we're sharing that and Ella also got the Dark Knight one. Get it, Tim, try because the camera's balanced on the bin. <laughs> and here's the Halloween cookie. Dad, what have you got? Nice. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> what flavour? Vanilla, um, strawberry, and um, pecan. Oh, oh nice. that's flavour though, and you waste one on vanilla. <laughs> yeah, literally. <laughs> pins at Disneyland Paris like it's so hard not to buy all of them I'm doing my first purchase of this Anna pin also I'm gonna get this frozen set and the little fire bruni so cute I've also love all the phantom mana pins I love this one this is gonna be my li list to get but I do have one of these two at home but I really cannot remember which one it is so I'm not going to get one of those and this one's super cool. This is such a big pin. And it's green, which is $7.99, which I think that's really affordable for such a big pin. And the Anna one is also only $7.99, which is the cheapest out of all the pins you can get. So I think that's really cool. But Elsa is orange, so she's a bit pricier than Anna. It was also a really cute Phantom Manor lanyard. I don't wear lanyard, so I probably don't need it. It's just because I'm here and I see everything and I want it. There's so many different pins of Stitch. That one's super cute. But Disneyland Paris loves Stitch. They stitch everything here. I got it wrong. My eyesight, I read it as $7.99, but it's actually just seven euros for that pin not 7.99 I will show you the chat if you would like to know for a few come so green is 7 orange is 8 blue and yellow are 10 and pink is 13 and the pin sets have prices on it already so the frozen pin set that I'm getting is I think it is $19.99. Yeah, so the frozen pins that I'm getting is $19.99, so that means that they work out like five euros a pin, which I think that's really good. Do you? Yeah. Do you like them? Yes, yeah, it's, it's a good look set. Which one's your favourite? Um, the reindeer. What's the reindeer pull? It's um, the crystal. No, it's not Crystal. Um, Eric? Eric? What is it? Sven. Sven. Oh, right. <laughs> Eric. We're queuing for Hyperspace Mountain and look at the queue. It is super outside, long. Outside yeah. of the building. Dad, what's your opinion on this one compared to the Florida Space Mountain? This one's a lot better. Yeah? Yeah. Well, and this one mum will be able to get out of. Will I though? <laughs> mum can never get out of the one in Florida. I'm already having panic thinking I'm never going to get out again. This one's easier to get out of. I'm just worried about our stuff getting smashed out. Oh so god. Pins. And some pins are going to go. Oh my god, the pins! Pins! Oh, Dad's just had an ice cream. Oh, no. 40 minutes there, we've got time for it to go down. Time for it to settle. You see the Milky Way go past your eyes. <laughs> We're nearly there, so I'm going to put my camera away and we'll tell you what we think after. I know I'm going to love it though. It's always, good. It's always so good, isn't it? Yeah, it's going to be the best. I'm going to love it. I'm excited to see what Ella's reaction is going to be because she's never been on it before, so. It's going to be good. Do you think you're gonna like it, Ella? <laughs> <laughs> Ella's really upset. She's not impressed. Not going on it again. Everyone, show your spirit jerseys. No, that's for something different. Mum's spirit jersey. It's for something Mine. different. Mine. Dad's, Will's. 
and Ella in pink. <laughs> also, look how cute Mum's new lounge fly bag is with her ears. They match so well. We were gonna go on Star Tales, but we realised that our reservation for uh, oh, Park Gardens garden. is in five minutes, and we weren't yeah, even in the inside bit of the queue. It was, <laughs> I think, it was a longer queue than what it said. Yeah, but so we had to we had to abandon queue and make a mad dash for Plaza Gardens. But We'll go on it an another time. But yeah, we Also, will. look how cute this is. The Wally and Eve. It's so the cute. Statue. Luckily, Plaza Gardens is right next to Discovery Land. Like, Discovery Land's just there. And Plaza Gardens is here. It's kind of like a copy of Crystal Palace. So, at Plaza Gardens, it's not how it used to be. They bring over um, this platter for a starter. Um, I've got a salad, Will's eating something from that, Mum's got a salad, Dad's got a salad, Ella? Some bread. <laughs> Some bread. So I got the, the shrimp pasta without the shrimp and chose pesto, Ella got it with the shrimp. Will, what did you get? I got the rotisserie chicken. I've got the vegan risotto with um, mushrooms and asparagus. That looks good. Dad? Chicken. Chicken. <laughs> Our puddings have arrived and they're so cute. They are. That little pumpkin well. is the cutest thing. Not sure what he's made out of. No, I'm excited to try him. Ooh. Ooh. I absolutely love the decor in here. It reminds me so much of Tower of Terror. It's like the same era. These curtains are so pretty. And this mirror here. Absolutely love it in here. I've also changed my ears to the orange. Spark little sequin ones just because the jack ones were hurting my head too much. Um, and we're about to get our spirit jersey group photos in a second. Right guys, Plaza Gardens review. Puddings were great. Puddings were really good. The starter was not. Puddings were okay, the rest of it. A salad with raw cauliflower. Yeah, I thought the raw cauliflower was better and I was excited. As much as it wasn't what I expected, I enjoyed everything I ate. But risotto and was really nice. your mum had vegan risotto was really good, really tasty. Well, I don't know if I pay 36 euros and yeah. until COVID is over again. And it used to be free top up, uh, free refills on the drinks, and that's finished now. And then Hopefully soon it'll all be back to buffet. Isn't it? Yeah, I hope so. Do you really want to share this spoons and stuff with people? <laughs> yeah. I'd rather it be like how it is on the cruise. Yeah. Well, you but, buffet, but you pick. Yeah, you get them to put the things on your plate but um like i missed the old plaza gardens but i did enjoy this it just wasn't what we expected now we know yeah now we know and probably won't want, come back you till want a nice sit down yeah, in a you... nice location and something okay to eat then it then it's good i personally would rather go to annette's again i'd rather order burrito from the yeah. takeaway yeah that that burrito that vegan oh, burrito right. was my favorite so favorite thing i've ate this entire trip and yeah, it was a lot cheaper than this, so... You do the math. <laughs> yeah, you do the math. <laughs> well, the, dessert, the desserts were amazing. Yeah, the pumpkin was pumpkin. a chocolate mousse, and it was oh, amazing. Divine. And it had like a berry bit in the middle, very chocolate good. Chocolate tart as well. Yeah. We've made it to It's a Small World, we're just about to get into the queue. And this is so adorable. There's this new Perspex, like, barrier between each row, which is really good for COVID. And we're also in a boat. It's just us. Just all to ourselves. Yep. I love the topiaries. Just come into the princess. Is it pavilion? Pavilion, yes. Yeah. I don't think there's anyone, any of the princesses actually in. But yeah. Just come in to have a, have a nosy. 
Some stained glass windows, it's really pretty in here. Do you need a lamp? Join our noble company. If you want a big Mickey waffle, you come to the old mill, which is right opposite the teacups. So we're on our way to try Indiana Jones right now, so I feel like I can't go on it because I ate so much, I feel a bit sick, but I might just do it. It is a short ride, but we're in Adventureland and it is my favourite like area of Disneyland Paris. I love Paris of the Caribbean ride, I just love this area so much. I say this is my favourite area but I also love Phantom Manor. Like it's hard to pick my favourite between this little area right here and Phantom Manor. They're just... Nah, Fantasyland. <laughs> nah, Fantasyland's probably my least favourite for the aesthetic of it all. Ah, oh, what? That Princess Pavilion was everything. Yeah, the Princess Pavilion was very Ella. So we're walking up to Indiana Jones right now. We have got... minutes until the park closes so we're gonna yep we just made it super quickly as much as i feel absolutely so full i probably am just gonna go on it they're so cute walking dead vibe. it is walking dead vibe cute isn't the word i'd use to describe them but uh i know what you mean no they are cute i love them <laughs> i think i was a bit lost hey. <laughs> which is that the right way? Oh, this is cute. Where's me the jungle cruise? It's a bit jungle cruise. That scream reminded me of a roller coaster tycoon. Okay, I'm gonna put my camera away for this ride. This reminds me of Pandora. So we're leaving the park now because it's closed. I really think that they should be open till nine every night because oh, it would be much better to have those couple extra like hours. Early. I know, but it's still light, isn't it? in our 20s whatsoever. Nearly <laughs> 30. <laughs> <laughs> This eel is only 35 euros. It's so cute. These are dead good gifts. Yes. So something I wanted to get this trip was the Mickey Pumpkin Pandora Tramp but they are sold out of that. But they said you can get it online. Which is good. Yeah. But I have a feeling that all the Halloween stuff that I saw online Makes is all sold out, yeah. yeah. Which is a shame because bet, it's well, not even Halloween yet, but everything's sold out. Hopefully not the blue tip. I know. We've still got World of Disney, so yes, well, fingers crossed because World of Disney usually has everything. Yeah, normally. Normal so. so this is a really cool find. It's $7.99 and it's like a massive poster of the map. And it's cool because it's got like characters along the edge. This would be amazing framed. And $7.99 is so cheap for this. 
I really like that. Get this for our trade, so That's so cute, Mum. How is it there? Someone's made that. I know, it's amazing. Hold on. Oh, that's so cute, Mum. It's so sweet. That's just that's so good on my trade. Reminds me of Marshall, my cat at home. I miss him. absolutely amazing. I love that they did this Mickey orange for autumn. So beautiful. So we're finally out of the park. It's half eight. Yeah, eight thirty. So only an hour and a half after park closing time. But, you but know. We, we were in the shop and we were taking photos of empty Main Street and I was taking photos of the orange Mickey out the front, yeah. Yeah, in it's, front of the Disneyland Hotel. It's always such a vibe, Main Street, when it's like hardly anyone in it, and all it's all lit up for night time. It always looks so. Yeah, gorgeous. it's literally like so beautiful, and especially October with all the little ghosts and everything as well. So we're just meeting back up with Mum, Dad, and Ella. They're in the Disney store in um, Disney Village. We're in Starbucks, and they have the park mugs. If you're interested, I'm very tempted. That was just a better view of them. So here's World of Disney. I'm so excited because it's the first time going in it this trip. In the World of Disney, they've got these Nuimos. I, I don't know how I'm, if I'm saying it right. Hello, how would you say it? Nuimos? 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 But they're super cute. You choose which character you want and then you can dress them up. On Shop Disney, they have Jasmine and Ariel as well now. Do they? Yeah. I've seen in Walt Disney World they have Jack and Sally. Oh, I don't know if this is that one. They also, you can buy little spirit jerseys from that, yeah. No, that's so cute. Yeah. I saw the Jack and Sally ones in Tim Tracker's video. Aww. So we're just ending the vlog from yesterday. Today we're going to the Disney Studio Park, so that'll be in the next vlog. Yes. So, so thank you for watching. Please subscribe. Yeah, and we'll uh, see you in the next one. Bye.